Hi everyone, welcome back. In this video, we are going to discuss about cash basis in accounting of Odoo 60. So here, in the accounting module, you need to go to the configuration settings where you can enable the feature cash basis. So here you can see a feature to enable that is the cash basis. Enabling this feature will allow you to add the cash basis journals. So let me add it as cash basis taxes and save it. After saving the settings, you can now go to the configuration tab here under the tab. You can see the taxes here. So click on the taxes and you can see all the taxes. And if you want to create a new tax from here, you can create a new tax. You can give the tax name, the tax computation methods and you can give other details to create your tax so I'll go back and just select on the created tax and here you can see the tax name is tax 15% and the computation method is percentage of prices and here in the distribution for invoices you can see the account details and you can also see whether it is based on any other taxes and here down here you can see the distribution for refunds where you can see the account for the refunds here and now if you go to the advanced options here you have the option for tax exigibility where you have the two methods that is based on invoice and based on payments so basically cash basis is when the tax is due only when the payment is done not when the invoice is validated so only when the payment is done it is due so let us click on the method based on payments and here you can give the payment account so I'll be giving it as temporary account and let me save it and now let me go to the sales module where I can do a sales order so let me create a new quotation let me add the customer and in the order line let me add the products here and let me save it and after saving it you can confirm it and depending on the invoicing policy of the product in the order line you can create the invoice so let me create the invoice and let you confirm this so this is the invoice this is a draft invoice so once you have confirmed it, you can see it has changed to the post state and now we can register the payment for the invoice. And now let me register the payment with giving the journals here. Let me create the payment. And here you can see it is in, in payment state. So as we have said, cash basis is when the tax is due only when the payment is done. So let me create the bank statement for this and make it in page state so let me go back to the accounting module and here you have the bank reconciliation so let me create a new bank statement let me add the label and here let me add the partner and here let me give the statement and let me give the amount and let me save it and here you can validate it so I validated it and now let me go to the sales module and let me click on the sale order which I have done and going to the invoice you can see it is in paid state and now if you go to the tax reports in the accounting here if you go to the tax reports and if you filter it by this month you can see the sales here and if you click on audit you can see it has been entered 
because we have done the payment for the tax. So the cash basis in accounting of O216 is when the taxes are due only when the payment is done and not when the invoice is validated. That's all for today. Thank you.